show of hands. Who pays taxes? Another show of hands. Who knows how their taxes benefit their local government area? So how do we access that data? And more importantly, how does that impact on constituents' safety, education, and health? Hi, I'm Liz, and I'm the captain of the Codefather team from Tarim Technologies. And we're here to solve the problem of open source data access regarding the correlation between funding, services, and societal outcomes across local governments. Currently, information about government spending is fragmented. Each council must submit annual reports which outline their revenue, expenditure, and funding. But these reports do not demonstrate how this funding is translated into specific initiatives. Moreover, each state has their own standards of data sharing, comparisons of services across local councils. Our solution, an open source, aggregated, free data set, which is a consistent means of offering instantaneous access to relevant statistics for local government areas. Using our simple framework, councils all over Australia can share data and collaborate with each other, share best practice and identify gaps to more effectively lobby for funding and services. Additionally, we have created a channel for councils to interact directly with the federal government to raise awareness about issues being faced by their communities. We have used 10 data sets across crime, education and health and our solution is built in React and Node.js, hosted on Heroku. Our tool, Council Plus, is a data visualization framework that allows for council data comparisons with the click of a button, where councils are able to identify gaps, plan their funding applications, and petition the government. In the spirit of open source, so can local residents. You can see what petitions have been started in your area and join your neighbors in showing your support. We have started with the data sets for the seven local government areas of Greater Sydney, but we plan to expand this to all 537 councils across Australia. Future milestones include building an API to connect the petition building capability directly to the government's current system e-petition. We also plan to work with subject matter experts to improve the awareness indicators and identify trends and to move away from the historical data collection model to real time. We're the Codefather team and we hope that in the most positive way possible we are making local councils in Australia an offer they can't refuse.